Good evening. I'm Taylor Crosby. Thanks for joining us. A fire in Northport has left one family displaced. More in tonight's top story. Northport Fire and Rescue responded to Northbrook Apartments around 530 this evening. According to fire officials, the blaze appears to have started in the kitchen. The flames were contained to that area, but there was significant smoke damage to the laundry room and living room. The rest of the building's tenants had to be evacuated. They will be able to return home tonight. The same cannot be said, however, for the li family living in the apartment where it started. Officials say the cause of the fire is under investigation. Well, the Crimson Tide is headed to Atlanta next weekend to take on the Georgia Bulldogs in the SEC championship game, and tickets are already on sale. Prices for those tickets continue to climb as both Alabama and Georgia demolish their biggest in-state rivals. A few hours ago, the cheapest ticket on StubHub.com was $324.00. And that's for seats not far from the top of the dome. The seats close to the field averaged over $1,000. This game determines who will compete in the BCS National Championship game in Miami against Notre Dame. Bradley Whittington will have more on the matchup coming up in sports. Some West Alabama residents may be getting a questionable text message on their cell phones. It may look like this and claim you've won a gift card at Target. The message also urges people to go to the website to claim their prize. Target officials say this is a scam and is in no way affiliated with their store. One Target employee told WVUA this is common during the holiday season, so everyone needs to be extra careful when trusting deals that seem too good to be true. And, well, the countdown to the holidays has begun. We are officially one month away from Christmas. Hanukkah is just 24 days away, and the holiday spirit is visible all around town. Kids told us they can't wait till the reindeer and the sleigh show up at their house, and WVUA caught up with Santa Claus, who says there is still time where kids can make it to the ninth grade. For the University of Alabama, I'm Taylor Crosby.